If you want to get seen by everyone from potential new clients, recruiters, your old colleagues to make them jealous, your profile needs a couple of finishing touches that'll take you from a standard LinkedIn user to a LinkedIn pro. Here are 10 LinkedIn tips that'll boost your profile views. One more people clicking on your profile, you need to get that profile picture to stand out from everyone in the home feed, search bar and comment section. Make sure you're front and center and your picture is crisp and clear. Leverage colors so your profile picture pops out from the gray background and you can even put a colored ring around your profile to make it look like an Instagram story. Just so people will click forward and see if it plays. It won't, but you'll get a click onto your profile. LinkedIn used to have stories, but they're gone now. You'll see them trial new features from time to time and they'll roll them out gradually for users. Get more clicks onto your LinkedIn profile with a solution-centered headline. Lead with your title, company, then pack it full of results. What pain you help remove and what unique solution you offer. You've got 220 characters, so get creative, make it impactful and drive some traffic to your profile. So it'll show up next to your name on your profile and every time you comment, it'll show up next to your name on the comment section as well. It'll follow you everywhere. So you need to ensure it's putting the right foot forward for you. It's like an elevator pitch that follows you wherever you go on the platform. If you need help, you can always ask ChatGPT to pull some ideas together, but just make sure you're giving the right keywords to it. Stop using your middle name on socials. If people are searching for you, these will make it harder for you to appear in the search results. Even if you don't have an original name, it's best to use the name you go by on the day to day. And that does not include weird office nicknames as well. If you meet someone at an event and you introduce yourself, this is what people will search for. So if your name is Philip, you need to go by Phil, write Phil. If your name is Catherine and you go by Cat, write Cat. If your name is Richard, you know what to do. If you want a sleeker look in LinkedIn profile, update your LinkedIn URL at the top. Most people think you can't change this or have control over it, but you do. You can go from being a name and a bunch of random letters to a clear name easily. It'll make your profile look more optimized, help search results rank your profile, and it will show you're smart enough to set yourself apart from the other profiles. All you need to do is go to your profile and click edit public profile and URL. When the smallest details and tweaks are personalized, it makes the page itself look more authentic, and that's what you're looking for. People don't want to work and buy from potential scammers, so you need to give them reasons to believe your page is official, well thought out, and showcases you're the best person for the job. Will a URL alone do this? Of course not, but enough tweaks will go a long way. The biggest way to get more profile views on your LinkedIn is posting, hands down. But that's easy to say, everyone says it. But what isn't mentioned is what you should actually post because just anything on the feed isn't going to boost those numbers. LinkedIn beginners will post free things, job updates, shares from the company page they're feeling brand loyal and happy weekend posts. Job updates will get a few likes, but the content will do nothing for you. You have to post valuable content or only you would know, actual advice others will follow and breakdowns of complex industry news, which you can decipher for the people that need to know. Not everyone speaks your industry lingo, so explanations can go a long way. Fly in with your offer and big promise, what you achieve with your clients, and your content will draw in not just more people, but the right people. Speaking of people, number six, engage with other people's content. Drawing everyone in with your LinkedIn content all the time is wrong. Why? Because there is only so much traffic you can pull in with your content alone. To open up more ways for people to find and get to know you, you need to comment and engage with content around the platform. A quick growth hack is finding a LinkedIn influencer and engaging with their posts, effectively leveraging their network. This works on other platforms as well, such as TikTok, YouTube, and Twitter if you're desperate. Just make sure you don't write thanks for posting or great content because it doesn't actually add anything to the content. This is your opportunity to have your say and look like an expert. So read the post, summarize your opinion, and or add more to it. People will see your comment and if they like what you have to say, we'll check you out, your profile and your content. Number seven, hashtag your audience. Hashtags are pointless, right? AI can categorize your post with the content alone, so you don't really need to add any additional tags. Yes and no. Hashtags are still used to kickstart social algorithms to put the right content in front of the right people. On LinkedIn, you can follow hashtags and topics, so there's more chance if you use a certain hashtag, you'll pop up in the feeds of the right people. These right people aren't in your industry, so you don't tag your post with your industry, just because you're talking about a specific thing within that industry. Simply put, if you tag marketing, marketeers will look at your content. And if you're posting to attract business, you don't want people that do what you do looking on your profile. You want people who need you. So use the tags that they follow. This way, they'll see your content, gain some insight from it, and check out your profile. Maybe even give you a follow if the content is good enough. Now, I mentioned follow instead of connect because that leads us to number eight, which is 
you need to turn on LinkedIn creator mode and this is why. LinkedIn has a drive to get creators on the platform because more content means more people on the site, which makes them more money. Simple. By turning on creator mode, you're already telling LinkedIn your profile is the people they want on their platform. You get to add profile topics, create newsletters, and have access to live events. You can add up to five profile topics, which will help your profile appear in search results. And this is where you can list out the topics that you talk about to drive the right people to your page. Newsletters are a great way to nurture your connections and expand your reach. If you're looking to be a thought leader, this is your playground. Create long form content for your audience and share and really showcase that you are the expert. Okay, so we're on to number nine. Number nine, run events on LinkedIn. If you wanna be seen as an expert on LinkedIn, you need to be running live events on the platform. You can put on live webinars, Q&A sessions, or drive group sessions off platform to Zoom or Google Meet. This will massively increase your views and engagement for your profile. People will see your live, hear you talk, and see the value that you offer. When it speaks to them, the next step they have is to check out the rest of your profile, look at your content, and maybe even reach out to you. Now, public speaking and live sessions can be quite terrifying for some, but it's the best way to add a personal touch to your marketing and essentially get your name out there on LinkedIn. Finally, number 10, become a LinkedIn top voice. Here's how you can get a blue tick on your LinkedIn profile. Top voices on LinkedIn, which is previously known as LinkedIn Influencer Program, are members who are constantly active on the platform, who share valuable expertise through content, and they demonstrate their unique original contributions to any topic. If you wanna be one of these, you simply have to add your insights onto their collaborative articles, in particular, some skills. These are AI-generated articles that are being enhanced by experts using their own opinions and insights. Their contributions are upvoted as insightful, and these articles are tucked away in the skills pages, which you can find using them in this link. With enough contributions and upvotes, you'll get vetted as a top voice and get a fancy top voice badge on your profile. Enough recognition and you'll get a little blue icon next to your name. And this will show you're a viable member of the LinkedIn platform and worth checking out. This will boost your reach and authority on the platform. So there you have it, 10 different ways you can boost your profile views on LinkedIn. Go use them. And if you learn anything from this video, please give it a like and subscribe to us here at Maverick. Also, check out our latest videos for more steps that you can take to win at LinkedIn.